shoe. Keep the ball. Keep the ball. Now, put the ball right there. Put it down. I'm doing so many things. I Good boy. To be forgettable. Oh, oh. Okay, put the ball right there. Back away. Oh, man. Oh, are we getting ready? Are we getting ready to throw the ball? That's all he wants out of life. And he never gets tired of it. Well, you know, when I came in, I've never seen the dog asleep. But when I came in, he was passed out on the head and, and never moved. Never. Did Deb tell you the story about, I don't remember what, what holiday it was, but she went home. So my husband and I come over and let the dogs out for her. And so we came in the morning, let him out, came back in the afternoon, and Job meets me at the door every time. And... And I'm looking for Zeke. And Carl and I are going through every pet of the house. And I'm thinking, oh my God, I know he was in the house when we left. Right. Where's that dog? Where's that dog? I start to freak out. Walked out again. And I don't know why, but I just looked again toward Deb's bed. And there was a white blanket on the floor. He was curled up sound asleep on the blanket. And I didn't see him. And of course, we're yelling and stomping, thinking he'll hear the fire. Right. He didn't budge. And I don't know why. I you know, it scared me. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. Put him on a white sheet. You no, cannot no, see no, him. That's not bad. <laughs> You're so good. You're so good. You... Oh, my goodness. Get the ball. Get the ball. You want me to get the ball? I'm going to get it. I'm going to get the ball. No. No. I don't know. Oh. Put that ball up there. Put the ball. Zeke? That's a good boy. No. You come right to the same spot every time. You're such a good boy. Okay, we could do this for hours. Get the ball. Get the ball. Pretty Zeke.